Hello, welcome to DIY Machines. In this video, I'll offer some inspiration on how to decorate your BB-8 by showing you how I decorated mine. If you've just joined us in this video, this is part three. You'll find a link up here to part one. Let's go. Start by covering BB-8's head with several coats of white acrylic paint. This will help to blend in the various different white materials we've used in constructing his head. Now we can start adding some more detail. To begin with, I'm using a pencil to draw the shapes that I want to colour in, and then I'll be using some Sharpie permanent pens to colour these shapes in. These are ideal as I get great control, and because they dry almost instantly, there is very little chance of me smudging it. If you're not sure which patterns to draw, I'd recommend googling some images of BB-8. This is all I did to get my patterns. I'm using the plastic handle of a cheap paintbrush as an antenna for BB-8. To do this, I've snipped it off and then I've coloured it in with my black sharpie. You may find this hard to insert into the head, so make a hole with a screwdriver first and then you'll find it easier to insert the paintbrush handle. The other additional parts are added to his head using a hot melt glue gun. Now it's time to paint BB-8's body white. I'm using some high coat white primer as my base. Follow the instructions for use written on the side of the can. Now you're at the stage of decorating BB-8's body. Now I've created this. This is a stencil which helps you draw the geometric patterns on his body and then will also double up as a stand once you've finished your BB-8 and stop it rolling away from you. If you'd like to support my channel, this is available on my website as a digital download, which you print yourself, for £2, of which about £1.60 finds its way to help support my channel and help me create more videos in the future. If you'd like to help me, please consider purchasing one of these. There's a link in the description below to where you can purchase and download it. Thank you. Use four pieces of masking tape to seal the two halves of the ball together and hold them in place whilst we decorate it. Space them around evenly as this will help decide where you're going to draw your markings. There are six markings that need to be made, one on the top and bottom and four going around the sides. To start with, I lay the template on the top of the ball and I'll use my pencil to trace the various shapes. Once this is complete, I found using various different sharpies, including metallic ones, is a great way to fill in the details. Now if you smudge the pencil markings as you're working, don't worry, this only helps to add to the aged look of BB-8's body. Once you've finished one set of patterns, you can use the template again to help draw your next one. Just include and exclude various different parts of the template, and this will help you create all of the patterns that you'll see created on mine. Now that your work is done, you can replace BB-8's head and then take him out for a drive. If you've enjoyed building your own BB-8 following these guides, please think about supporting this channel with a donation on Patreon, you'll find a link below. Otherwise, until next time, ciao for now.